Is that like a Game of Thrones reference? Isn't that a woof? Oh, hi, what were you? I couldn't see well enough to see what you were, but you looked... There will be some cool music that goes with this. It's not here yet, but it will be here soon. Howdy, everyone. I am Nathan Blake, and welcome to Perdita, created by Azazor slash As a Game Studio, a really nifty-looking horror game that is rising in the ranks on the Ichio popular page. My name is Devin Delovey. The year is 1989. I'm researching the legend of Julia Brown, a voodoo priestess said to have lived in Munchak, Louisiana, 20 years ago. The legend goes she cursed the town. She foretold that upon her death, she would take the whole town with her. Shortly after her death, three hurricanes hit the area, leaving death and destruction behind. I will investigate Julia's house to uncover the truth about what happened to her and her husband. Charles, this is some dark applier looking stuff right here. It's great. I love it. The, the, it, it actually, like, bothers my eyes a little bit having it like with the blue and the red the, the soundtrack's really good so far I think that's super neat the game seems to have gotten stuck it's just frozen the music's still playing though all right looks like it's loading in I've reached the residence of Julia Brown I can't believe it I should check the port before heading inside doesn't look like I have a flashlight the my head wobbles in a weird way when I move it which is kind of strange but Anyway, uh, this is just the spoopiest, but it is really high quality. Look at the size of this dragonfly, it's ridiculous, I love it! Man, this is ridiculous, ah, uh, there's two of them. There's two of them and they're gargantuan, things the size of my head! <laughs> okay, so let's see, we got his house here, I didn't, I think he didn't, around. um, okay, well... You know, this is looking like it's gonna be just the spoopiest. Eat, interact. Can't open. Oh, no, I can totally open that door. Oh, that doesn't look. I don't look good at all in there. I don't know about that. <laughs> you, you enjoy being in their room. I'm gonna look elsewhere. Let's see, we got a, a cigarette, an ashtray we can examine. So, this is definitely giving me some of those more like uh, syringe. Hmm, narcotics at play here. Some of those like uh, much more. PT sort of vibes, which is, is a good feeling. Like, it's very good and good gravy. Why is it in all of these games that the people have just the worst art that they could possibly have? Why does it all have to look absolutely horrifying? <laughs> Who has that kind of art on their wall? Julia Journal number one. I keep having the same dream. I dream I'm sitting on my porch. I sing my usual song. I wish everyone in this town will die. The day I pass away, I call upon the spirits of air. I see into the future. All the hate you cast shall come back to you eternally. So mote it be. What? What? That, that, this, this letter escalated quickly. Boy, that escalated quickly. From, well, you know, it sure does suck to be, be, wow, I actually really like the, the fact that I can see my feet, and the animation is pretty smooth. This is high quality. Yeah, she sure went really, uh, like, a long way really quickly from just being like, you know, I like sitting on my porch. Everyone should die! Okay, can I turn, okay, cool, I can turn on lights. That's good, because it's very dark. I'm not gonna lie. Could this be Julia Brown and her husband? Okay, space to take? What happens if I take it? Can't take this object. Okay, I didn't think so. It didn't seem like something that really made sense. My feet go out pretty far when I step, though, I have to admit, because they're, like, above everything. It kind of makes me feel like I'm floating and I have short legs. <laughs> and what is this picture? Wow, again! Why would you have this kind of art in your house? Okay, I guess I have to head into these back rooms now, which I really don't want to, because they're literally horrifying, but that is the point of horror, I suppose, so on into the creepy back rooms I go. Hello? How are y'all? Okay, hi, 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 whoa, why, again, why the, f why just the freakiest artwork that you could possibly muster? Like, it doesn't make any sense. Like, what was that sound? Who made that sound? Was it you? You, sir, did you make those noises? Why are you in here with like marijuana growing on you? That is marijuana, isn't it? I was making a joke, but I'm pretty sure it's marijuana. I also found the key, so I'm taking the key because I'm assuming that it's gonna come in handy. Wow, there's a lot of bugs. Like not even just a few bugs, but like more bugs than anyone has business having in their house. Like, why would you have this many bugs? They're all over everything. And again, they're gigantic. Those are flies, and they're like the size of my hand. Oh, gross. Wow. They really understand art in this game. I get that. <laughs> flashlight battery. A flashlight battery. 
I'm gonna take the flashlight battery. Old gramophone player. Yeah, let's try. Oh, hi, hi, what's happening? What's happening? Why did it happen? Why did the whole screen shake? Why is, okay, turn on the lights. I'm turning on the lights. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. Nothing bad is ever going to happen here because I am, am a very safe person in this creepy, creepy old house. Ah! Why? Why? Why is the whole house shaking from that? Good gravy. Okay. Oh, why does this keep happening to me? Okay. We're fine. Oh. Oh. He's just, is he at the front door? I'm already in here. You can't be in here. Only only one per per, per day. Only one person is is blocked. Oh! Why is it this? Oh, hands and eyes. I need something to get past here. What do I need to appease the hands and eyes by giving them all like Rubik's cubes to play with? Like what the heck? What what kind of object am I gonna get that's gonna help me with that situation? <laughs> okay, I have to find the closet. Okay, here we go. I have I have the key. I know I need a key. I have it. What what do you want me? To, how do I how do I use fire gun equip? No, nope. no melee or fire gun equip. What? What, what do you mean? Also, fire gun? What do you mean fire? Oh, hi! Wow! What a face! Dinner room, door, okay. Okay. What is that? That is, that's the scariest thing I've ever seen in a video game. That's, who, who, who made that video? Why would they make it? It's horrifying to so many degrees. Air and fire? Is that like a Game of Thrones reference? Isn't that a woof? Oh, hi, what were you? I couldn't see well enough to see what you were, but you looked... Oh, okay, hi, boy howdy. I think I almost dislocated my own so shoulder just now. Okay. Uh, my husband Charles spent a lot of time working in the old wreck of a car. We live in Manchick swamps, so a car is dreadfully useless here. Canals surrounding our small community ma makes most people use small boats. Electricity has been acting up again in our old house, but I will leave it to Charles. He built the house himself back in the day. The voodoo doll on the table serves a specific purpose. A needle is inserted into the heart region. Some folks say it brings love. Some folks say it kills. But what is life without love or without risk? That, again, she her messages sometimes just kind of make a jump, a, a illogical jump from one place to another. I mean, that really got out of hand fast. Looted all with a single needle in it. Okay, why am I in this room? Ooh, another letter. Note to myself by Charles. <laughs> hey, Charles, I'm writing you a note. I'm Charles, by the way. Charles, in case you didn't. Charles, Charles, Charles. I have recently been on a few fishing trips. I love being away from my wife and enjoying nature. It's an artist's wonderland, you could say. Nature in, in his... Blah, blah, blah. Nature in itself is a piece of art. Still, I need to find myself dwelling on creating the perfect piece. The electricity has been acting up again in our old house here in Manchik. I think I left the gas can to this generator in the fishing supply room. The only problem is I can't seem to remember where I put the key. I think I might have dropped it somewhere in the bathroom. I still have to go looking for it soon. Not only is electricity acting up, but we seem to be plagued by a rat infestation. Those creatures will gnaw through everything. I apologize. I couldn't use our lord. I shouldn't use our lord's name in vain. Remain steadfast, Charles. Remember, Jesus loves you. Yeah. Write that, write, make sure you write letters to yourself too. It's very helpful in these stressful situations for you to write a letter to yourself from yourself. What is this? Why is this happening? Why did that happen? I don't understand. I'm just walking. I didn't do anything. I'm just a normal man wandering around in a building. Why does, <laughs> uh, my life has become kind of, kind of the worst since I came into this house. This picture is actually luminescent. It's not just like a white picture. It is actually glowing. So I'm kind of really bothered by it. I don't know how to deal, how to like, how to react to it personally. Can I leave now? Can I just leave? That seems like it would be the right call for me at this point. You <laughs> know, I tried to solve this this thing, but apparently there's nothing I can do to solve it because we're all gonna die. Oh, okay, there's another bug next to a statue. Apparently I'm just gonna die here. So, okay, hello, hello, what is, what a, no, stop that noise, I don't like that noise. Why is that noise happening? The noise, ha it stopped, it stopped. I don't like it, I don't like it at all. Why did it happen? Oh, hey, a key, another key, dining room key. Cool, I picked that key up. Now I can go in the dining room. I'm sure that's gonna be fine and helpful. Oh, what's that? What was that? I saw something fly past the screen. Ah, stop it! Stop it right now! I don't like you at all! Blurb! I'm scared. I'm spooped. The spoopage on this game. Just look at the spoopage. 
See, I can't use keys that I have. I actively have keys and I'm not allowed to use them and I don't know why. Okay, I have an inventory on tab that I didn't realize I had. So I guess I should go ahead and like equip my... There we go, I equipped my closet key. So now I should be able to unlock this, but I, it's not unlocking. There we go, okay, so you have to actually click use item on it to get it to function properly. This is definitely not gonna go well for me. Man, that door creaked for like an hour after it opened. I'm just assuming once I get in here that not good things are going to, to happen to me. Let's see. Guitar, Julius Brown's guitar could be worth a lot. I don't don't see any anything I can do with it. Um, this says interact with door, but I don't have a door around it. How am I playing a piano through the wall? That, oh, I'm playing the piano. Good, I'm playing the piano through the wall. That's a great place for me to be in my life right now. Okay, well, let me try this one now that I can successfully open it. There we go. Okay, so you have to have it equipped and use it. Oh, good grief. Stop. Oh, come on. Why the doll? Why the doll? No one wants to see that. No one wants to see that kind of garbage. What's wrong with them? Oh, look, a lamp. Do I get three wishes? Magic lamp, not sure this helps me. I mean, it definitely helped me if I could wish to not be in this house anymore. Like, why is that happening? Why is there a sound currently happening? I don't like it. Old spyglass can't take the object. Good gravy, what is this game? An old radio. Okay, hello creepy doll, how are you? I'm, let me just apparently just step on your feet repeatedly now. Eh, I'm stepping on you. I hate you, you're the worst. Fishing room door locked, okay. Well, it's really unhelpful, but okay. Oh, Julius Journal. My husband, Charles, and I would rarely have guests for dinner, but when we did, I made sure everything was perfect. I forget where his this brain came from, but it would be the last thing I ate before I died. It tastes particularly sour with a slight sweetness to it, reminding me that in the worst humanity, we can find some things to cherish. My sweet Charles, how I wish you could paint a picture to illustrate this feeling I have now. Did you, do you, did you eat your husband's brain? Rotten human brain, disgust. Oh my goodness, why? Why is this happening right now? I, I'm very, I think I'm gonna vomit. Just a little bit of vomit, not a lot of vomit, but definitely more vomit than I'm generally comfortable with on a normal day, you know? I found another note over here on this chair. My husband stays up late every night. I'm starting to think he loves his art more than he loves me. I even put spells around the house for him to notice me, but nothing seems to help. Okay, well that's a weird way to react to that problem. I'm afraid my husband might enjoy art more than he likes spending time with me, so I'm casting voodoo on him! Oh, another battery that I don't necessarily need currently because it's for a flashlight that I haven't found yet. Old telephone, no phone calls from the old, oh boy. Wait a second, I recognize that. That was in, that was in, uh, uh, that heightens Seek or Die. I played Seek or Die, is this by the same guy? Okay, wonder what the symbols on the back mean. Oh, uh, you know, it could be an egg thing. Wait, this is another battery? I found another battery. If I ever find that flashlight, I'm sure I'm gonna enjoy using it. <laughs> oh, hey, hey, you weren't there before. I don't feel like. If you were, I just didn't notice you and you're really horrifying, like everything else in this house. Oh, good grief. Oh, hey, is that another key? That is another key. Item picked up, which key is it? Red drawer? Red drawer? Does this count as a red drawer? It does, okay. Equip item, use item. You Use item, open the drawer. Death toll of storm place 3,500 storm hits Manchick, Louisiana. Okay, I don't, okay, well that doesn't really help me. No, knowing that, that people died in a, in a hurricane is not actually helpful. Oh, there's plenty of drawers. Oh, I picked up a flashlight. Oh my goodness, yes. Okay, I finally have a flashlight, which is pretty cool. And it looks like I have batteries for my flashlight. I don't know if I'm gonna need it, but it's very helpful. Oh, there's two doors here. I didn't see one of those doors. Oh, okay, here we go. 
Here we go, right next to the fishing door appears to be the bathroom, and the bathroom is where I'm after. And we all know that, like I've said before, bathrooms in horror games are always the safest place to be. A mirror shows us our past, present, and future mind is crafted with the finest black obsidian with a handmade bronze frame. I've spent countless hours looking into the abyss within myself. I'm beginning to understand I have a beast within me, a certain urge we all possess, something I can't, I must control. In the mirror, I see my future. I see me being alone, finally united with my unborn little boy. Yeah, you know, this is just getting as spooky as it can. Also, I, I think I'm wasting my flashlight battery as I sit here looking at that. Oh, okay, hi, hi, hi. No, it's fine. It's perfectly fine. Whatever is happening right now, I'm sure it's gonna be okay. There's an arrow pointing at the, pointing at the door. Why is this still going on? I'll close that door real quick. That's gonna make it safer in here, right? Right? Definitely safer in here now. I don't see anything around here. I'm looking for a key. Somewhere a key has been dropped. I know that. But I don't know where. One eternity later. Alright, so I've been searching around in here for like forevers. And I don't I don't know that I'm ever going to find the key. Because unless it's like back behind here or something in a weird... Oh my goodness, there is a key! Oh, thank God. Okay, so I've been searching all over this bathroom. I've been looking in the sinks and stuff and all kinds of stuff. I would ne- Ah, oh, that's so frustrating. It, it's been- I've been looking for a while. Okay, so we got the fishing room key now. So now we can- we can move forward. I wasted all of my flashlight battery already. Okay, uh, use that key. Okay, so now we're in the fishing room. I can't see well enough in here, but maybe my flashlight, I mean, my flashlight, oh, no, good gravy. Okay, got the gas, go back to the stairs. Good grief, that was, I didn't even see what happened. It just made horrible noises, essentially. <laughs> oh boy, I like how uh, the music is really kicked up all of a sudden, but not really, apparently, because it's back to normal now. <laughs> Okay, it said to go back to the stairs. Oh, I'm just gonna burn them. I just burned all the eyes and stuff with my gasoline, apparently. Oh, hello? Okay, boy, howdy. Those are the rats, I guess, that they're having problems with. Thanks, I appreciate- Okay, this game needs to calm the heck down, because it's just been going crazy for a little while now in a very startling fashion. Now at least- I What was that? What the heck was that? I saw a- some sort- Ooh. Oh, gross. Hello, what are you? You seem a little... You seem like you're not doing very well, creepy bag thing. I'm assuming that you're... That you're just, uh... Oh, hi. Hi, more of the eyes. Oh, good. Hello, eyes. You are clearly very happy to be here. I know I am. This house is getting worse, I feel like. Like, I feel like the whole house is just increasing in, in badness. And in, in not happiness. And I think it's not gonna get any better in here. Oh, hello. Um, um, I don't, no, I don't think so. No, I don't, <laughs> I don't think so. Nope. Okay, clearly I need to go ahead and come in here. Good grief. Oh, a little, uh, why, why, why puppets? Why puppets? Journal 9. For a long time, Charles and I tried everything I have a child. When countless attempts failed, I would blame Charles for it. Even though I knew it was because of my body, I decided to make my own child with a doll. But I put a wish spell to turn this doll into a real child. Eventually, he would become alive at night. Oh, I loved him, but Charles never would accept him and hated me for what I had done. Well, you know, it's kind of the worst. And absolutely horrifying. Oh, why? Why with the pictures? Why? Why must... Oh... Oh, thank you. No, thank you. Okay, well, this is just the worst. This game is absolutely horrifying. Camera? Ca oh, I have a camera now. Oh, oh, come on. No. No. No, I, I just, I just well and truly refuse. <laughs> no, 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 you do not. Okay, let's, I think this camera will do things. Hey, how's it going? How's it going, little guy? You doing okay? You look like you're having a good day shooting me just right here. Halloween 3, okay, good. All right, well, I don't really know what to do now because all I, alchemy book, perhaps? Alchemy? Why, well, she's did voodoo, I thought, not alchemy. Oh, good grief. Why do I have a camera? Why is the camera something that I needed? What, loft door, you need a key, okay. 
All right, good, another room. Filled also with dolls and mannequins. Why dolls and mannequins? Why? Why is this happening to me right now? I, oh, I hate this. Oh, all the heads follow me. This is one of the spookier games I've played in a while because it's just kind of messed up and awful, like everything is. Journal 10. Sometimes lock myself in the mannequin room? Why? Sometimes I practice turning them alive. Charles has said he saw one of them standing beside our bed late at night. I tell him not to worry. I have them under control. They trust me indefinitely. What's this wish spell? May the goddess and god of love, light and love, grant me my wish and quiet my heart. I place my desire in your hand for you to do as you will, and I deserve so note it. So, so mote it. Samantha. Voodoo dolls with mark of death. His fourth conviction, my life as a black magician by Ferrand. Evity's high priest sent to try to silence tech. Uh, why is this my life? Why am I, why am I here? Why am I playing this game? I, I can't, oh my goodness, this game's making me sick to my stomach. I don't know about you guys, but it's just a, just a little unsettling to, is that, is that one just a head on a leg and it is still falling? You, you leave me alone. You, you creeper. You creeper, creeper. You spoopy creeper face. Oh my goodness. Okay, well, I'm glad that this is all actually happening to me. I just need to now find a key or something, I'm assuming. Because, wait a second, what? That goes out onto just like a landing or something? Oh no, that's like the roof, I guess. Wait, there's something in these drawers. One of those drawers has a glowing something something in it. If you look from the side, there was a, there was a glint. Oh no, it wasn't. That was a... That was just a sparkle. That drawer is jammed and the other one contains a thing. Okay, well, this room is worthless, I guess. No, no, you weren't there before. No, I know what this room was like before and you weren't there and I hate you and you're so creepy. And what's this one? Really, what's this one? Okay, so there's so many keys and stuff that I need now, I don't even know what to do because I've checked all the rooms and they've only gotten more horrifying over time. Good grief. I'm gonna throw up. Hey, what are you doing out of bed, young man? You you lay down. Oh, look, look, we got a battery, and we got a key to somewhere. What is that a key to? Bedroom. Oh, good. I'm sure the bedroom is gonna be full of all kinds of happy, bappy, fun times. Woo, doggy, that bedroom gonna be so much fun, I'm sure. Oh. Okay, use use the key. Oh, hi. Hi, how you doing over there? You feeling all right today, Mr. Shadow of Death, evil guy? I'm sure you're having a real fun time. Why, why would there be a, uh, stop it, no. Oh my, ugh, gross. Why are there hands? Why hands coming out of the walls? Eight. My husband believes in his savior, Jesus Christ. I do not believe in religion. I believe it enslaves us in a thinking certain way. I am, however, highly spiritual. I can send sushis all around us. Let Charles put his savior up above our bed. At night, I feel the statue's dead eyes staring at me. Lady, you cannot talk. You've got literal mannequins that you've brought to life that are hanging out staring at you. You've got problems. By the candle, I do sleep hidden from the day, blah, 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 blah. Okay, all right, I gotcha. I gotcha. You got... You got some real spooky problems. And, ah. Uh, toy train, Julia has become a mother? No, she just had like a super creepy doll obsession, that's all. They didn't become a mom. She just got, she just became a crazy person. You got problems, lady. You got real pro, what am I still doing here? Why am I still here? Like, like, what has possessed me to remain in this home? As soon as the hands start coming out of the walls, that's when we should start realizing that there's a real problem. And then you start seeing this kind of crap, like a sheet with a monster underneath it. Why would I still be here at this point? Someone tell me the heck's going on. You stop moving. I don't know. None of this is okay. Literally none of this is okay. Okay. I'm assuming this has me getting real close to the end of this because because there's just can't be that much left to this house, you know? Like, wait, I just used the key. Did I not just use the key? The key disappeared. What? But I did, I used the key. Oh, if you tell me that this game is broken now. Oh, good, the little boy's gone, that's good. Little creepy puppet boy is missing. 
That's great. I'm super happy about that. Hey guys, any of you got the key that I wanted? Cause, cause I used a key and it seems to have not worked. Oh, I accidentally used it on this drawer through the wall. Okay. In my happy place. No more, no more upsetness over that. Okay. <laughs> That's okay. It's perfectly fine. No worries. Clearly nothing. No. See, you've worn out your welcome now, okay? You've worn out your welcome. I'm not even. It's not even that spooky anymore. It's just. It's just gross. Okay? What, why is that recording just like a, a walkie talkie being turned on and off? And why is there a Union Jack on this trunk? And an American flag on the other trunk. Oh my goodness, okay, 11. I always keep the loft room door locked. I have been creating my own little world in this place. My healing sessions with visitors also take place here, hence why the additional beds. I love helping my patients. I would record our sessions through the answering machine on tapes. I would edit them on floppy disks on the old PC. That doesn't seem like something you'd be able to do very easily with a floppy disk and, a, and an old, like, cassette tape. But of all this went horribly wrong on the 8th of September. Lately, a dark presence has been lurking in the house. I can feel it in the walls. Yeah, it's you, lady. You're the, you're the creepy voodoo person. In the air in my mind, an intruder is lurking in the house. The intruder which the eyes cannot be old. I'm afraid I cannot keep this secret anymore. I, Julia Brown, murdered my last patient with an axe to the core. I even tried eating his brain in the dinner room afterwards. I tried to clean the bed also, but it is impossible. Do you know how hard it is to get rid of blood? The presence took control of me. Oh, please forgive me, my charm. Charles, please forgive everyone. Um, forgive me, everyone. So she murdered somebody and then was possessed by their spirit, and then she went and murdered people, like like Charles and stuff, and then she wanted to... Why, why is this happening to me? Why is the house shaking? Why did that happen? Oh, okay, hi, monkey. You know what? You're messed up. You got some real problems, Mr. Monkey. I don't know who you think you are, but you got some real problems. Okay, we got an axe. We got an axe. I don't know what the axe is for, though. Like, I don't need the axe, to my knowledge. But I guess, is it is it my weapon now? Oh, good, I have an axe. Die, monkey! Oh, boy. Okay, good, I can finally chop monsters in half. Which is all I've wanted since the beginning, is, is to kill the monsters. Alright. You know what? It's time for you to meet your, your maker, Mr. Monster, in a, in a sheet. I don't know what your problem is, but you're going down. Mannequins? You wanna you wanna you wanna go to Pain Town mannequins? I'm a wumpage! I got got some some wumps for you, all of you. Okay, oh yeah, there's a jammed drawer, right? Alright, let me unjam the drawer with this axe. That should that should definitely work, right? Ref effective against wood is what it says. Well what what wood am I supposed to be oh Oh, I see! I see, I did see a putty tat! Okay, here we go. Alright, come on- oh. D no. D okay, hi! Hi, this is certainly happening. Uh, escape the house- but I have a letter to read! The locals used to remember me! As a beloved local hero or not a revengeful type, to the person who's reading this, this is my confession. I duly murdered my husband Charles. I locked him inside this coffin. After I killed one of my patients in a part of the brain in the dinner room, I could hear Charles gasping her air, yelling for hours. When silence finally came, I took a final glance at his lifeless body. After this, I went to the tallest tree outside the bathroom window and hung myself. Before, uh, before I knew this evil spirit that had taken over me will bring me back even more powerful, but on one condition: I can never leave this place unless I destroy it completely, unless a living soul discovered my secret. You're reading this, you are already dead. Oh, good. Good! I am so glad that this is currently happening. I- ah, oh, good gravy, why? Okay, all I gotta do is- oh, Okay, hi! All I gotta do is get out of the house, and apparently this is not effective at killing wood, even though it claimed that it was. No! No! Away you go, lady! I'm gonna break your guitar. That's what I'm gonna do. Your guitar's going down. Okay, where- where- I'm out of here. I'm out of here. No! No! Stay away! Good grief. Back off. I'm out of here. Goodbye. Goodbye. Oh, there she is. I saw her. I saw her. There we go. <laughs> Alright, so this is good. I thought this was well done. There's some really spooky stuff. Some of the game is a little more difficult than it should be. Too hard to find some of those keys. But we got there eventually, right? So, uh... I enjoyed it. Uh, it definitely gave me a bad feeling in the pit of my stomach, which I think, of course, is kind of the, the point of, of video games. Oh, one of the testers. Press escape key to quit de to desktop. That, that was my favorite tester. <laughs> Definitely, you know, gave me a good spooky feel. Um, there was something about the way the character moved that, that actually made, like, the head wobbled a little bit. It gave me a little motion sickness almost, although my stomach was already a little, little iffy when I started playing the game. But uh, I think it's really well done. Uh, like I say, some of those keys were difficult to find, so I might 
you might make some of those a little easier to find. The ending was incredibly creepy. Like, like it did a good job of building to that suspense of escaping the house and the monster being essentially after you at that point. And I definitely felt like pretty creeped out as the stuff was happening. This had a good handle on tension and release. It would definitely build to good creepy moments happening. Um, so I really, I really appreciate what they did here, and uh, yeah, I, I, I want to thank you all so much for being here. I know this was a slightly longer video, but uh, we're doing two a day now, so I can, I have the ability to do a shorter one and a longer one. So we did it. This was gonna be my longer one for the day. So uh, anyway, thank you all so much for being here. As always, we will see you in the next one. For now, this is Nathan Blake signing out for Nathan Blake Games. Remember that games are art, and art is important, and so are you. Sayonara.